So here's the power button. It's gonna tell us how much battery it's got. So it's not fully charged, but it came with a charge already, which is awesome. So I want to charge it up before trying it out. And now let's take a look at the important part, which is the back, because this is gonna be against your head. Now, although it looks like it's gonna be something soft, it's not, but that's because we're supposed to place this. Now, this is actually soft, and this is what actually will make this feel a lot better. So right here, we can just set this up. I don't know why it doesn't already come with this pre-installed. I guess they want to show you that you can take it out to wash or anything like that. But you can just snap in the sides. They do have this clipping right here. There you go. And it just clicks in. Now we have like that space. And this will go against your head. So it should be a lot more comfortable that way. Anyways, here's my Quest. And I have it with this installed. You know, this is what it comes with. So we're going to need to take this out in order to place this right here and snap it in. All right, so the first thing we have to do is take these guys out. So what a lot of people don't know is that it's actually really simple to take them out. You just have to apply some pressure and you're gonna see the snapping out. So let me just focus in a little bit better if I can. So here we go. I'm just gonna start doing this and then it just snaps out. So there you go. So just apply pressure to the outside so that way, you know, nothing breaks. So here we go, it's just gonna snap out. So here we go. So these are the ones that come, you know, installed with your Oculus. Now what I need to do is also just take this out. So I can go ahead. This is the easiest part. So all you have to do is just take it out like so. It, it will make it easier if you take out this part, this piece. But it, it's no big deal if you leave it on for this part. But again, if you want to make things easier for yourself, just take out this part. And then you're going to see that this just comes off a lot easier. So here we go. That's how you guys can just take these things off from your Oculus. Just pop really easy out and that's about it. The next step would be to place this. So this will go on your head, obviously. So what you guys need to do is just place it like so. So see this part, this texture, that will be going down and this will be going up. And that's because this will snap like so, right? To make it tight. So you need to have that open. So let's just install it in. So here we go. And we can just put the like so for now. We can go ahead and just place this. You don't have to right now, but it's just better to get out of the way. So we're just gonna pop it back in. Now that it's in, you're supposed to see that this is good to go. And now comes the battery part. So how do you place this? Well, just look at where your cable's gonna go. And that's how you know what's the right hand side and how to place this correctly because this will need to go right there plugged in. So we're gonna do that next, but for now, we're just gonna place it right here. And it's really easy. Again, it's supposed to just pop in and that's it. So we're just gonna go ahead and pop it in there. So that's one side. Here comes the next side. So you're going to see that gap you can just move this up and then just right here pop it in it's supposed to click in there we go nice and tight so there we go your oculus is all set up and obviously at this point what you can do is just plug this in so this is the last thing that you want to do plug that in right there and you've got extra battery life right now so you can play longer Especially if your Oculus is older at this point, you will need that extra battery life. Now what I forgot to place was this, so let's just place that. Of course, I'm gonna have to adjust this as soon as I put it on my head. But for now, I'm just gonna leave it like so. So it's gonna look like this. So here's the battery pack on the back, fully adjustable. The cable is not that long, but long enough. So once you adjust this to your head size, which again, all we have to do is just turn this to expand it out. And what we're gonna do is actually expand it out the whole way. So that's the maximum that it goes. So it actually goes quite big. As you guys can see the cable, it's still good. It's not super tight or anything like that. There's still some wiggle room, which is very important, especially if this is for you, your head's that huge, which uh, I don't think anybody's is. <laughs> but if it is, you guys can do that. And we can just close it up. We're just gonna close that up again. I'm showing you 
the maximum that it can close and the maximum that it can open, just so you know what you're getting. But here we go, that's how it looks like, the battery on the back. I can tell you the back does not weigh more than the front. So that's good to know, but it does have some weight to it now. So it should be actually a little bit more comfortable because it's gonna be evened out. It shouldn't be slipping to the front like they usually do after a while. And that would be the big difference between getting one of these and just using what came with your Oculus or your MetaQuest 2. And once again, I do wanna stress this, that MetaQuest 2 is just a rebranding of Oculus. It's actually the exact same product, exact same company. It's just rebranding, that's all. You're gonna get the exact same thing. Things that are compatible for Oculus 2 will be compatible with MetaQuest 2 as well. So right now I do have it turned on by mistake, but anyways, it's on right now. And I can see that this is on as well. But as far as this unboxing goes and setup, we're all done. If you guys wanna check out the review, make sure to check it out in my channel. And in the description of this video, you will see where to buy this from, which is from Amazon. It's just a direct link that's gonna take you to this product. But anyways, as of now, we are all done. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.